Right then, it's been a while since we've done a video, um, especially on the Alpha ESS systems, uh, the hybrid system we do now. Uh, the customer is currently having uh, a battery storage system, 8 kilowatt storage, a hybrid inverter, is having uh, 8 panels on the front, the roof has already been, uh, he's put 8 on the front and he's put 4 on the back. So we are now following up from what the roofers did. It's Friday today, so we've got a job nice and early, eight o'clock this morning uh, in Southport. Um, so yeah, give you a bit of a walk through, sort of before job. So Reese has already got ladder all up and ready to go. So down the side of the property, um, he's gonna have the back storage system, just where that ladder is. Uh, the electrics, as you can see with the car charger cable, uh, the electrics is just on the staircase just there we're going to install the battery system just here so before anybody comments i just want to point this out that blown brick wasn't us <laughs> it was done by the people who installed the ev charger so they've obviously drilled kind of straight and yeah it's it's blown the brick so um yeah just to clarify this that wasn't us Back to the video and the dc cable run we're going to come down in some conduit uh, just where reese's ladder is just there straight down and straight into the system um, ac route's just going to go straight behind the system and straight uh, into uh, fuse board on the staircase I'll show you on the back now this customer's also had uh, pigeon proofing to prevent uh, Pigeons getting all even seagulls, Bela. <laughs> yeah. As you can see, I'll try and zoom in on there so you can see. You can really see it, but yeah, so he's got some pigeon proofing around there. He's got the old rewirable um, fuse board to pull out fuses, uh, so we can't go into the current fuse board. Uh, we tend to like to put his own board in anyway, just to make our system. Uh, all up to regulation so as you can see he's got an old board in there um, the guys who installed charger on Tux Energy put their own board in um, and we're going to put ours just to, uh, to the side of that I think um, put the handle box a bit close to the gas uh, light but um, we'll probably enter the bottom side of that but yeah that is the job We'll probably drill out on an angle to get behind our system so we're not seeing the cable in and then straight up into AC isolation point. Yeah, so that is the job. We shall check in with you afterwards. Job done. I arrived here at 8 o'clock this morning and the time is now 12 o'clock. So, four hours, uh, it went really nice and smooth, uh, no hiccups. So yeah, I'll show you around. Even packed away for 12 o'clock. It's because he's not been on his phone all day. <laughs> DC run, you can see there. That's DC run from the front side. Um, that's one string, all leveled up. And then that's two strings, again, all leveled up. Downstairs to the battery. <laughs> battery down the side I think it looks really nice what we've done is if you've noticed we've not uh, we've left just enough room for another battery if the customer wants to add, a, add another battery system uh, we tend to do this on most jobs some jobs we leave at least two uh, for two batteries um, but for this one just the one uh, so if she rings us back it's gonna be an easy uh, an easy install for an extra four kilowatts so yeah this is the alpha system DC run in conduit, nicely clipped up in the loft, down straight into the system. Uh, this here, this is a cover, uh, the screw here just comes off, that comes away and we've got a DC isolator uh, in the side of there. Um, MC4's plugged straight into the side of it. AC run uh, under the stairs, the fuse board we put a new fuse board in there um, and then sort of drilled it on a slight angle to get over here as much as we possibly can. 
straight up to isolate and then loop straight in. I'll show you what we've done here. But yeah, so we've put a fuse board in there, fuse box, uh, ran it straight, hooked up straight in. As you can see, you've got all your SPD devices, you've got your main switch, you've got your bi directional uh, RCBO, uh, bi directional um, solar PV gem meter, um, and then straight tap straight into the block. So, yeah, doing the good one. Got your CT clamp down there. Uh, this CT clamp here monitors the, uh, the customer's uh, home load. Uh, to tell the battery when to discharge and charge. But yeah, all your labels all up. Jobs are good. Up. So yeah, that is the full system that I really like. The Alpha systems, really easy to install, easy to commission, and it looks really, really nice. Yeah, so that's that. So jobs are good and off to it next.